Hi guys, my name is Daniel, and in this tutorial, I'm going to introduce you to some of Zen Studio's latest mobile development features. In this video, we'll see how to create a new cloud connected mobile project, use App Agility to configure back end services, add some new UI elements to our mobile app, and then preview and export it as a native mobile application. Some background info before we start Cloud Connected Mobile enables developers to easily build end-to-end -end mobile applications that span platforms and operating systems, evolve over time and pull from multiple data sources. App Agility is an API builder designed to simplify creating and maintaining useful, easy to consume and well-structured APIs. OK, so let's get started. Our first step is to create a new Cloud Connected Mobile project in Zen Studio. To do this, I'm going to select File New Cloud Connected Mobile Project from the menu bar. I'm going to now name my new client side mobile project, which contains my mobile application, and the server side project that contains all the back end services plumbing. I'm going to select my Apache's HTDocs folder as the project location, and my locally installed Zen server as the PHP server. Clicking Next leads me to the Templates dialog. Here we can select from a number of different templates, each with different content and code packages. For this tutorial, I'm going to select the Simple Services template, which contains a basic implementation of exposed web services. Clicking Finish creates our new Cloud Connected Mobile project with two separate components displayed in the PHP Explorer the client-side mobile project and the server-side API project. Two editors are automatically displayed, the mobile applications configuration file and the App Agility editor. Since this editor requires certain composer dependencies, Zen Studio will now add them to the project, together with composer support. Let's begin our development work by taking a closer look at the server-side App Agility project. As you can see, the template already includes an existing API called My Company, with a defined REST service that we can begin to work with. Selecting the service gives us all its details, general settings, fields, documentation, and source code. App Agility Services can be tested in Zen Studio by clicking this Test Service icon that's displayed as I hover over the top right corner of the service. This opens the test service view. You can see that the test service view contains the method route, request fields or parameters, and the method type. I'm going to now send out the request and hopefully receive an OK response. Great. Exploring the response details, we can see a list of the customers returned from the database. Next, let's add a new customer. I'm going to add myself in the Request Parameters table and change the HTTP method to POST. Testing again, I get a 201 created response with the added customer. Retesting the GET method gives me a full list of all the customers, including myself. Now that we've played around a bit with our back-end service, let's move to developing the client side of our mobile application. Before we do so, let's preview the app at its present development state. To do this, we first need to deploy our services to a server. So in the PHP Explorer, I'm simply going to drag the App Agility project onto the local Zen server in the PHP Servers view. I'm going to verify the app URL and click Finish. Zen Studio deploys the project to Zen Server. Great! All we have to do now is right click the mobile application in the PHP Explorer and select Run as Cordova Sim. Let's see what we've got here.
what we're going to do now is add a new page for adding new customers. By the way, all the code snippets you're about to see are available in the written version of this tutorial on the online help. So first, we're going to add a new page to the UI with input fields, a submit button, a text area for response info, and a back button. So I'm going to open the application's index.html file and begin coding. Next, we're going to add a button that links to the newly created Add Customer page. We're now going to bind the submit button we added on the new page to a new function called post customers. To do this, I'm opening the my.js file in the projects.js folder and entering some code inside the relevant block. Then I'm adding the implementation of this function. And last but not least, I'm going to add the helper function on post customers for handling the response from the post request. Let's save the project and preview it again in the simulator. Great. Now let's see our services and UI changes in action. Now, say you want to check out your app on a native platform, no problem. If you have the relevant SDKs installed, you can simply right click the project in the PHP Explorer, select Run As, and this time select an emulator of your choice. Once you're satisfied with your development work, you can export the application as a native application package for further distribution. In the mobile applications configuration file, just click the native platform project export link. Select your platform and the destination folder and click finish. That's all there is to it. Zen Studio provides you with an optimized environment for developing testing and building mobile PHP applications. For more info on mobile development in Zen Studio, please check out the online docs on zen.com. Thanks for watching.